an experimental VR mode is available to test in Race Room Racing Experience. I've added details on how to do this in the description below. It's a little unstable at the moment, so this is a very brief look and first impressions. I can't seem to get the instrument panels to work, so I was having to guess what gear I was in, but in terms of the actual VR implementation, it seems really solid. The tracking seems excellent, both rotational and positional. They've got low persistence and chromatic aberration correction enabled. The overall impression of scale seems correct. It's all working very nicely already. I'd say it's pretty comparable to Live for Speed. There is one issue with the arm animation only turning 90 degrees away from the centre before stopping. If you disable the arms, the wheel will rotate beyond 90, but it doesn't feel that comfortable when your body seems to be invisible. I'm expecting it to be a problem with eye racing as well, as their arm animation also stops beyond a quarter turn. It's not a massive issue, but something that I hope the developers are aware of. Apart from that, VR is absolutely amazing as usual. For instance, it lets you appreciate some of the interior modelling that you'd otherwise miss, like this switch up here. It might look pretty strange on video, but this stuff is fascinating in person. The replays are going to be great fun too. These wide angle shots are incredible. The mountains look enormous and this fantasy track suddenly feels a lot more real. As always, it's the sense of scale that is really impressive. Being able to freely look around using the replay cameras is a lot of fun, but there's too many tracking shots at the moment, which can make you feel a bit sick as it keeps wanting to take control of where you're looking. I hope they can add a bunch of static cameras from various vantage points, so it feels like you've actually come to watch the event in person. That's a brief look, it's a great start by Sector 3, and I'll be definitely covering Race Room in more detail in the future.